Hey guys, it's Phoenix. So I do want to revisit the enchantment video that I did last week. Uh, so I have looked back at the comments and a lot of people have been telling me a couple of things. The first one is you can actually duplicate enchantments. So you can have multiple sharpness enchantments on a single item. Actually, before I tell you guys that, yes, the second thing is the enchantment level maximum is not 32,767, it is in fact 2.1 billion. I am not going to grindstone this, so if one of you guys wants to grindstone this, please do it with a video if you want. I do want to remind you that 32,767 times about 30 or so enchantments is going to take around an hour. So yes, here are the stats for this diamond sword. It is sharpness 2.1 trillion with 1,014 sharpness enchantments on this single sword. And that does about 500 billion hearts. This is a thorns sword, which does 1.2 trillion hearts of damage if you get hit. To demonstrate this, I'm going to summon a spider and punch it and hold the sword. And the spider will commit suicide through 1.2 trillion hearts of damage. Um, Alright, so these two are really just uh, demonstrative, uh, I'm not really going to uh, go into too much detail with these, except for the sharpness one, I'll do a little bit of uh, teaching at the end. So, this, these numbers are incredible by the way, I had a lot of trouble, you know, looking through the calculations, but a lot of these you don't really need to worry about because with the number this large, who's going to care? In the, in the practical sense. So this is a diamond sword with a knockback of 2.1 trillion. You can see that there is some variation in these numbers because of the character limit, which is 32,500. So with a longer word, um, it means you can't fit as many enchantments. So this is 1014, which has the same number of characters as the word sharpness. Um, so this does 6.5 trillion uh, blocks of knockback. So if I summon a... Uh, no, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> no, I did it myself. It's going to crash the game. Uh, because the game is trying to push the entity back 6.5 trillion blocks. No, uh, you can't have that many blocks in the game anyway. That's probably why. Uh, so here is a more practical knockback sword, which has um, 709.8 million level knockback sword, and that does 2.13 billion blocks, which is, of course, too many. But watch what happens. Nothing. Uh, so no, don't use a knockback 709 million. Okay, let's move on. We have a looting 2.3 trillion. Again, looting is a shorter word, which meant I could fit more looting enchantments on the sword. Uh, 1,082 of them. And we have... Here we go. I'll put these commands in the description if you guys want to play around with them, if you ever so choose to. These last few ones are from my Twitter followers, by the way. And this has the potential to drop 2.3 trillion drops. Here is another one which has a similar sort of efficacy to it. This is Fortune 2.3 trillion, again with the same number of characters as looting. And it has a maximum drop count of 2.3 trillion. Now, this is a percentage, so what that means is it's not actually going to drop 2.3 trillion every time, it's roughly half. So I have a possible enchantment of 250,000 for Fortune. This one my computer actually can handle, believe it or not. But this one I can probably record with, so here we go. Okay, so it is beginning to process, I have to shift a bit further back. Alright, that's 2,500 entities, which... If you multiply that by 64, because each stack has 64, it's probably around 130,000 items. So yeah, it's a little bit more than half. So this actually dropped a few more than my last run with this, which is why I can't actually do anything right now. But all I need to do is just do kill uh, E type item and press enter. And hopefully the game can run that command even though it's crashing. Perfect, it did it. <laughs> So that is uh, Fortune 250,000. Now, the reason why I'm not showing you this one, which is uh, 1,000 stacked together, which would be Fortune 1,000, is because the game actually doesn't stack Fortune properly. So if I run this command again, which is Fortune 2.3 trillion, and break it, it's actually going to drop nothing. And it's not even hanging, the game's actually still running properly. So uh, that's one of those nuances in the game, which I'm not entirely sure why it does this, but... Fortune is just one of those exceptions. Similarly, so is Protection. So I would like to share this with you. This is uh, Protection 2 trillion, again, versus Sharpness 2 trillion. Uh, the problem is, this is not going to be a good contest at all. 
Uh, even so, with these numbers, Sharpness is going to win out. The problem being, Protection caps its damage reduction at 80%, um, even though I have Protection 2 trillion. Uh, so if I do this, I have a zombie. And one thing to note is, I have a more stacked on the chest plate because with numbers this large, it's only going to take the first number into account, the largest number into account. So it doesn't actually matter. I can kill him in one blow. It doesn't really do anything because the damage reduction is capped at 80%. Uh, the way this works is um, anything above 25 is theoretically going to do zero damage because of how, how tiny the percentage is. Uh, otherwise, protection 25 is just going to be invincibility. So this is all that I could really come up with. Um, again, if you want to take one of these enchantments and put it inside, well, even the largest one actually, put it inside a grindstone, feel free to do that if you have a computer as powerful as the sun. Please notify me, even more so the numbers are ridiculous. Thank you all for watching, thank you to the Twitter followers for putting your suggestions in. If you guys have any other things that you'd like me to try out, make sure to leave them in the comments, otherwise thank you all for watching, leave a like, subscribe for more creative content and news updates. Take care.